So I want to, here. Huh? It's wonderful. It feels so. Ah! Ah! I'm going to be 90 years old any day now. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to believe, you know, uh, but it, it has really made me think a lot about what I've been doing all my life, ever since I'm a little tiny girl. And <clears throat> the question keeps coming up for me, does dance make a difference? You know, you go through your life with dirty feet. Is it worth it? Nobody pays you for what you do not enough to live on, so you do all these extra jobs just so you can dance. Does dance make a difference? So when people, when they say, I'm a, a pioneer of postmodern dance, tell you the truth, I don't know what the hell they're talking about. <laughs> I'm not the postmodern dancer of anything. I just dance. I just use movement as a way to uh, uh, plug into who we are. Uh, I, I think that there are two ways to look at movement. One is when the mind informs the body. There are ways in which the body can inform the mind. And that combination is really a delightful way of working. <sighs> Use the breath to expand, use the breath to release. When you come back to normal, use the breath to be in that beautiful space of nothingness. Art that arises out of the inner landscape and is connected to our actual life experience illuminates the darkness and heals the soul. Okay, so you want this Those, and that. Yeah. Do you want it on that board or? Yeah. Does dance have, uh, does dance make a difference? You know, I can't preach it. You have to experience if it makes a difference for you. It, it does for me, but I wanted to ask you that question. Get ready to send our messages out. Ready, gonna go like this, pa. Ready? <laughs>